So yeah, today we are playing as Tonky in Potato, which uh, has a mass HP modification to increase by 25% plus 1% damage for every 3 mass HP you have. Plus 3 HP recovered for inconceivable, so I guess that's good. Minus 100% lifesteal, eh, don't care. HP regeneration modifications are reduced by 50%, so, mm, that's gonna be tricky to deal with. And dodge modifications are reduced by 50%, uh, not a, not a really big deal. And the big deal to me is the speed modifications are reduced by 100%. Yikes. And we're doing this one with tasers only, and we're gonna see how fast we can get the tasers firing. So, I think this is gonna be an attack speed focus build. And I think that's going to be after we get, uh, some harvesting, so I think all the money from this way will be spent on harvesting. Which means a fertilizer. Oh well, it, it is what it is right now. And that's what you won. Get some more... attack speed. And spend all the money on fertilizer like so, because I can get away with it now, and then get a plant. Water to two. And yep. Still just business as usual, so that's good. And that's what you do. Get some more damage. Actually, scratch it, I want more max HP because that means more damage. At least one percentage point. So, let's get another taser. Follow that up with uh, more fertilizer. Ultra Toy 3. And it's still just business as usual. Also, I think I forgot to mention that we are doing this on Danger Zero, and it's endless mode. Also, uh, all the mods that I use in this video will be linked in the description below, and that's where you can find them. So, yeah. Hmm. But he, so far, it's just a standard issue A3, and that's a good thing. I don't know how I'm gonna deal with the lack of speed. Maybe just plenty of armor. And that's A3. Uh, let's get some more harvesting. For more money. And let's uh, grab a coupon. Followed by another taser. And then uh, move on. Ultra 24. And it's still business as usual. So that's good. And that's 24. Uh, get some more elemental damage. And some more luck. And let's grab a coupon, follow that up with a another taser. And then another coupon, follow that up with a fertilizer. Ultra 25. Business as usual, I see, so that's good. And let's say 5, take the blindfold. And some more mass HP. And let's take the last two coupons. Follow that up with the last two tasers. And then get some coffee for some more attack speed. And now the cooldown is 0.7 seconds. Ultra 26. And it's so far just business as usual, so that's good. And that's 26. Take some more attack speed. And some more elemental damage. Now the tasers are doing 13 damage. Let's upgrade those tasers to make them even do even more damage, so, uh, yeah, hmm, where'd the tasers be if I was a taser? Oh, yeah, right here. And that's all we can afford, let's get a medical turret. And I think I'm gonna get the improved tools as soon as I can, uh, just for some more, uh, healing. And then let's get the last fertilizer, and now we have 83 harvesting, move on to 27. Welcome to 7 and I see it's gonna be a standard issue, uh, 7 for Danger Zero, so I guess that's good. And that's 7 Uh, I don't think I want the small magazine this time around. Or the sharp bullet. And get some more attack speed. And some more range. Right, and this is the part where you try to see if I'm recording properly, uh, which I am, so that's good, so, hmm. I guess let's get another medical turret. I'll buy an, an improved tools. And then medical turret spam. Ultra Toy Bait. Well, it's just uh, business as usual, so that's good. I'm gonna just start in rapidly increasing my engineering stat, aren't I? Oh well, it is what it is. And by engineering stat, I totally meant the elemental damage uh, stat. Just to uh, help out with the DPS. Although I suppose... Uh, 
uh, getting a ton of attack speed would also help with that because that would mean the tasers are firing more often and that, and that's a good thing for getting rid of the enemies. Hmm. And that's what you've ate. Take the scared sausage. And some more attack speed. And now the cooldown is 0.53 seconds. So, hmm. Let's grab a Sifid's Relic and then a Magical Leaf if I can afford it, which I can. So, let's uh, get a Wolf Element instead. Welcome to 89, aka the Speedy Boys Wave, aka a standard issue 89. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's good. Yeah, I definitely need some more attack speed though, so maybe some upgrades are in order for the tasers. And it's wave 9. Uh, recycle the blindfold this time. And recycle the metal detector. Get some more engineering. And some more harvesting, please. And then, uh, let's upgrade those tasers into the tier 3 variants. Like so. And then, I guess, uh, see if we can get a diploma, which we can. Like so. And then get a field tank. And another scared sausage. Welcome to 10. Where it's just business as usual. I need some more attack speed, though. Yeah, I think some more attack speed is in order, so maybe some coffee after I get a vigilante ring or two. So 10. Take the crit chance. And some more damage, please. Speaking of damage, uh, two vigilante rings, please. And, hmm, I guess, uh, two scared sausages, like so, and then a snake, like so, and then a copy. Now the cooldown is 0.49 seconds. Welcome to wave 11. I need some more medical terrors, don't I? But oh well, at least it's just business as usual, so that's good. And that's wave 11. Take the medical turret. And get some more mass HP. And then let's uh, acquire a magical leaf. Or two. And then let's get some more fertilizer for some more uh, harvesting. And then move on to 12. Like so. Welcome to 2012. We are still business as usual, so that's good. And that's wave 12. Uh, get some more regen. Even though that only increased it by two. Oh well, it is what it is. So let's get a couple of tractors, like so. Hmm, maybe another one. And that's all we can afford. So, yeah. Hmm, can we get a crown? No, we can't. So let's get some more coffee for some more attack speed. Like so. And now the cooldown is 0.42 seconds. Welcome to wave 13. Where it's still just business as usual, so that's good. And let's wave 13. Get some more crit chance. And some more damage. And let's see, now I think a couple more magical leaves would be good. And then, hmm. I guess we can get a few more coffee. So, yeah. And now you have 12 coffee. And the tasers now have a cooldown of 0.34. Welcome to 14. I'm gonna have to upgrade the uh, uh, damage that they do per shot, aren't I? Oh well, I guess I can worry about that later. I'm gonna uh, worry about surviving wave 14 uh, now. And that's wave 14. Take the magic to leave because that's a freebie. And let's get some more elemental damage. And speaking of elemental damage, let's drive a wolf helmet. And some more diplomas. Like so. And let's grab some more coffee. Because why not? Ultra to 15. And it's a standard issue wave 15, so no changes there, so that's good. And that's wave 15. Get some more harvesting. Speaking of harvesting, let's finally uh, get that crown. Like so. And let's see now. Hmm. What do I want more of? You know what? Uh, let's grab the magical potion. Oh, by magical potion, I mean regeneration potion. I completely misread that, didn't I? Oh well, it is what it is. So, let's see now. I think I want some coffee spam now. Like so. And let's move on to a 16, and now the tasers have a cooldown on 0.25 seconds, and uh, yeah. 
Welcome to 2016. And it's still busy as, as usual, so that's good. Let's say 16. Restart with the weird ghost. And take the tree. And get some more range. And some more max HP. Actually, stretch at attack speed. Which is now at 285. And let's finally upgrade those Taser 3s into tier 4 variants. Like so. And yep. Uh, hmm. I might have approached the wall in terms of the, the cooldown speed on the tasers right now because uh, the taser 4 and the taser 3 has no difference in the uh, cooldown. Oh well, it is what it is. Welcome to 2017. So I think I should probably fix that with even more attack speed. Yeah. I think that's the issue is that I just don't have the attack speed for uh, that. Oh well, it is what it is right now. Uh, uh, that's 2017. We talked with the metal plate. And the Wandering Bot. Get some more luck. And let's grab a recycling machine like so. And then upgrade that final Taser 3 into a Tier 4 variant like so. And then grab another Wolf element like so. Or two. That's also fine. And then uh, let's grab a Diploma. Like so. And move on to Wave 18. Welcome to 2018, and no changes to report in terms of uh, how the waves have been going lately. So yeah, I might actually uh, beat wave 20. So that's good. And I can just move on uh, to playing Danger 5 again as a button, or rather the chunky. Yeah, and also the gotten because uh, technically I've already completed a run as a gotten and got past wave 20. Oh well, it is what it is right now. And that's wave 18. Get some more attack speed. And some more max HP. And let's see now. Hmm, I think some more tractors are in order. Welcome to 2019. And I'm probably gonna spend all the money uh, from this wave on silver bullets because the next wave is wave 20, which is the boss wave. And the end of standard issue. Potato, and then it's on to endless mode after that. And that's a 19. We start with the wheat. And take the tree. And get some more elemental damage. And some more attack speed. And some silver bullets. Right, so that's seven silver bullets. Uh, let's grab some toffee. Like so. Now the cooldown is 0.21 seconds. Welcome to 2020. There's the boss. And... There goes the boss. So, yeah. That was great. So, I guess I'll see you at 2020. And that's 2020. We start with the injection. And the white flag. And the poisonous tonic. Take the med kit. And... Let's see now. Hmm. And that's some more range. And some more attack speed. And now the cooldown is 0.19. So, that's good. Hmm. What do I want more of? You know, I suppose the, uh, Vigilante Rings and the, uh, Magic Elisa would synergize this run because of, uh, yeah, the... Chunky has a plus one damage for every three mass HP you have, and... The Magic Elisa gives plus three mass HP at the end of a wave. And the Vigilante Ring gives plus three damage at the end of a wave, so those synergize pretty well, actually. Hmm. But I digress. I think I want some more tractors, please. Right, that's all the tractors we can afford. Welcome to 2021. This time I'm gonna have to get some vigilante rings or some uh, coffee for some more attack speed because, uh, yeah, I want to uh, just increase the attack speed as far as it, it will go uh, in this run. So that's a goal to work towards. But I guess that's for future prep clear to worry about. Current prep earlier is just gonna uh, worry about surviving wave 21. Yeah, and that's wave 21. Take the tractor. And some more elemental damage. And some more max HP. And let's see now. I think I want some more magical leaves. And then some coffee. Like so. And 
let's see now. And I guess the Metal Tutorials have their cooldown ring. Uh, deuce by 192.5%. Welcome to 2022. And I guess that's why you get the improved tools. As to reduce the cooldown on Metal Tutorials. And all of your other turrets, actually. So, yeah. And I guess that's why you should always get the, uh, improved tools if you're, uh, working with the buildings like that in Potato. And that's only 22. We're stuck with the white flag. And you let the rest. And get some more elemental damage. And some more harvesting. Right, so, let's see. Now, hmm... I think I want some more coffee, please, so yeah. Oops, I guess I was pressing the shift key instead of the enter key like I should have been, and that was the, uh, thing that popped up whenever you press the shift key, uh, five times in a row. And there goes all of our money. Now the cooldown is 0.11 seconds on the uh, tasers. And the medical turrets have their cooldown reduced by 352.5%. Ultra 2023. And this is what that cooldown looks like on the turrets. So that's quite fast. I think they can stand to be faster though, so I guess some more copies in order. After I fixed the damage deficit, because uh, yeah, minus 52% damage. Yikes. And uh, that's only 23. Recycle the butterfly. And the mastery. And get some more harvesting. And some more attack speed. And let's see now. Oh yeah, vigilante rings. And I have nine of those. Ultra 2024. And it's still business as usual. So that's good. And that's 24. Recycle the metal. And get some more harvesting. And some more mass HP. I just realized I have minus 25, um, minus 28 lifesteal now. Oh well, it is what it is, so, hmm. Let's see now. I think I want another vigilante ring just to cap it off at 10. And then, hmm, what do I get more of? Oh yeah, medical turrets. Let's get more of those. And now I have 21 medical turrets. Onwards to 25. And uh, yeah, that's what uh, 25 medical turrets looks like on the map. So I guess I'm going to have a ton of HP regeneration options uh, just for the turrets alone. And uh, yeah, let's get hit by one. And it's already healed. So that should be a good demonstration of that I just turned the potato into an AFK game if I just stand right here. And that's only 25. Recycle the sunglasses. And get some more crit chance. And some more luck. And let's get some banner spam going. Just so I can get some more range along with side the attack speed. And that's all that we can afford on that front. So let's see now. Hmm. I don't think I want the spicy sauce this time around. Yeah, that was the thing that I unlocked after the button run. And let's see now. Hmm, what do I get more of? I guess I can get some more weird food. And now the consumable heal is seven. Watch it twenty six. Business as usual. And now the tasers go out really far. Although I think that just tend to be a bit farther than than that, to be completely honest with you. So, I guess I'll work on that next time I'm at the store, so, yeah. And that's why 26. Recycle the power generator because it's literally useless, uh, as the chunky. Take the bad. And let's get some more harvesting. And some more armor because I somehow have none. So, let's get some more banners, please. And I have 980 attack speed. And, and a cooldown of 0 0.09 seconds. On the taser and the medical turrets had their cooldown reduced by 490%. Welcome to 827. And uh, yeah, I think we've reached uh, to the point where the tasers can 
hit the entire arena at once, so that's right. Huh? Oh, that's really 27. We start to the propeller hat. And take the fuel tank. And get some more elemental damage and some more dodge. And let's see now. Hmm. I think I want some more. I guess attack speed, so I guess some more copies in order. Yes, I'm pressing the enter key on both of my external uh, mechanical keyboard and the laptop's internal keyboard that I use. So, that's all the money we can spend on coffee. Now the cooldown is point, uh, six. Oh, point oh six seconds, and, uh, yeah. And the medical turrets have their cooldown reduced by... 695%. Welcome to 828. And this is what that cooldown looks like on medical turrets. And in other words, they're, uh, moving quite fast, so that's good. So I should be basically invincible if I stand in an... Uh, in range of enough medical turrets, to, uh... And that's what I think, anyways. Oh well, I guess time will tell if uh, that uh, is how it plays out in Potato, anyways. And that's way 28. Ooh, hey, a free medical turret. I'll take that, thank you very much. And let's get some more harvesting. And some more luck. Speaking of luck, I think I want some more wall formats. And then some diplomas. Maybe next time, though. Onward, Soy 29. Because now those medical turrets are healing, uh, one. And that's an issue. Oh well, I think that issue can be fixed with, uh, medical. Um, with, uh, diplomas, I mean. So, uh, yeah. Huh? Oh, that's Soy 29. We started the propeller hat. And the lost stuck. And get some more attack speed. And some more max HP. And some more engineering. And, speaking of engineering, let's get some Diploma Span going. Plus, it all gives, uh, it's P gain, too, so that's also nice. And, let's get another copy or two. Yeah, Kodan is now 0.05 seconds on the tasers. Welcome to 830, and I think there's a boss wave. In fact, there's a boss is right now. And, let's just stand right here, and just get healed by the medical turrets that I have. And oh wait, all the bosses are dead now, so I guess it's a standard issue wait now. I'll see you after wait 30. And that's wait 30. We start with the sunglasses, and the laser turret, and take the wheelbarrow. And get some more engineering, and some more attack speed, and some more mass HP, and some more elemental damage, and some more luck. Hmm, let's see now. I think I want some more Vigilante Rings, actually. And I have 21 Vigilante Rings. Welcome to 831. Where it's, uh, business as usual. And, uh, yeah, the medical, tur medical turrets are healing, uh, 8, uh, HP per shot, so that's good. And I guess that's why you did a ton of diplomas. Because they all get plus 10 engineering, and that's, uh, nice, especially if you've, uh, worked yourself into a deficit from, uh, getting some wall and spam going. Oh well, it is what it is right now. And that's like, uh, 31. We start with the spicy sauce. And take the lucky charm, we start with the hedgehog, and get some more luck. And some more dodge. And some more engineering. And some more harvesting. And, let's see now, what to get now, hmm. I guess it's time for some more coffee, for some more attack speed. So I guess I'll see if I dumped all the money into the coffee that I can spend. And, that's all the money spent on coffee. Now the cooldown is 0.04 seconds. On the, uh, tasers and the medical turrets have their cooldown reduced by 962.5. Welcome to 832. And this is what that cooldown looks like on the medical turrets. So, uh, yeah. I guess it's a standard issue wave now. So I guess I'll see you after wave 32. Uh, not say 32. We start with the leather vest. And take the alien ton. And get some more attack speed. 
And some more harvesting. And some more range. And some more armor. And some more regen. And let's see now, hmm. I guess I could go for some more tractors for some more harvesting. And, uh, yeah, that's all the money spent on, um, uh, harvesting. I guess it's onwards to A33. Welcome to A33. This time I'm going to get some more, uh, coffee for some more task speed just to see, uh, how, uh, much we can reduce the cooldown on those, uh, tasers. Oh, uh, next A33, so, uh, let's check to see if I'm recording properly, which I am, and let's, uh, recycle the explosive turret, and the landmines, and the blindfold. And get some more regen, and some more range, and some more dodge, and some more attack speed, and some more range. Hmm, I think I want some banners. Just for the range and the attack speed. And nothing else. And now the attack speed is 2,170, and the cooldown is still point, uh, zero 0.04 seconds, I think. But hey, the medical turrets have their cooldown reduced by 1,085%. Welcome to 834. And this is what that cooldown looks like on medical turrets. I think I might need some more medical turrets, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I think more medical turrets would be a good idea. And that's 834. Recycle the fin. And the missile. And take the max HP. And some more engineering. And some more armor. And some more max HP. And some more damage. Hmm, let's see now. What to do, 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 what to do. Oh yeah, I got some more coffee. Or some more task speed, so I guess I'll see how I dumped all the money into coffee. And that's all the money dumped into coffee. Now the cooldown on the taser is still 0 0.04 seconds. Yeah, I think I put the floor on the attack speed on the tasers. But hey, the medical turrets had their cooldown reduced by 1,405%. And this is what that cooldown looks like on medical turrets. And in other words, they're constantly pumping out uh, healing for me, so that's good. Huh? Oh, that's a 35. We started the alien worm. Take the attack speed, and some more damage, and some more uh, range, and some more dodge, and some more range. Hmm. Let's see now. I think I want some more magical leaves to be completely honest with you, so let's get some more of those. And now I have 24 magical leaves. Welcome to 836. And yep. But uh, wave 36 is a standard issue wave, so let's just stand over here to get uh, maximum coverage by medical turrets and then just save take the wave. Uh, that's wave 36. You know what? Uh, let's take the peacock. And the book. And the attack speed. And some more range. And some more mass HP. And some more armor. And some more damage. And, you know what? I feel like getting some Lucky Charms, so, yeah. I guess I'll see how I dumped all the money into Lucky Charms for some more luck. And, that's all the money spent. Welcome to 837. And, let's just move over here, and then just save trade the wave like so. Because it's, uh, just a standard issue wave, uh, where I just sit here and do nothing and let the game play itself. And, that's 837. Recycle the Dynamite. And take the alien con, and we start to the boxing glove, and get some more elemental damage, and some more attack speed, and some more armor, and some more, hmm, engineering, and some more harvesting, and some more elemental damage. Hmm, let's see now. I guess I could get some more coffee, so, uh, yeah, I guess I'll see how I could, uh, dump all the money into coffee. And we currently have, uh, 214 coffee. And a cooldown of 0 .04 seconds, so, yeah. And that's all the money spent on coffee. Now the cooldown is still 0 .04 seconds, yeah, I think, I think I found the floor on the attack speed. But hey, the medical turrets, uh, get their cooldown reduced by 1,772.5. Welcome to 838. 
And this is what the cooldown looks like on Metatrix So that's nice. And on 838, we start with the duct tape. And the baby gecko. And get some more uh, mental damage. And some more harvesting. And some more regen. And some more luck. And some more lifesteal. So, with that in mind, uh, hmm, I think I want some more coffee, so I'll see after I dumped all the money into coffee. And that's all the money spent on coffee. Now we have 351 coffee, and a total of 0 0.04 seconds. Yeah, I found the floor. On the, uh, how uh, low the cooldown can go. But hey, that's what the cooldown looks like on the tasers now. And that's neat. Hmm, when I to uh, see about, uh, what I can do about, uh, this run, though. No. Hmm. Maybe I should, uh, start increasing the harvesting by getting some more tractors. Oh, well. It is what it is right now. Or just rapidly increasing, uh, increase my SP gain, uh, per material by purchasing a ton of, uh, peacocks in the store. And, yeah, that's what I think I'm gonna do next wave. Because it should be enough DPS to deal with, uh, everything. And that's a 39, recycled the last touch, and the chameleon, and did some more attack speed, and some more elemental damage, and some more attack speed, and some more harvesting, and some more elemental damage. Right, so let's get the peacock spam going. And I am aware that it's a uh, boss fight. Oh well, I feel like resting it for the biscuit. So I guess that's what the strategy is going to be uh, for this wave. And that's 26 peacocks. Ultra 2040. I'm willing to bet if th that if I get hit once by the bosses, I'm gonna die instantly. Yep, called it. And there goes a the run. And that unlocks the potato thrower, which has a 25% range damage and 20% health, a crit of uh, 1.5, and a cooldown of point, um, whatever. Yeah, because I don't know what the actual cooldown is. Oh well. I guess I'll figure that out, uh, sometime. So, uh, hmm. I guess that's, uh, how far you can reduce the cooldown on the taser, so... I guess, uh, there's that if you always wanted to know that for some reason. Anyways, like the video if you liked it, subscribe to this channel if you want to see more of this kind of content from me, and pass this video all over social media if you want to support the channel for free. Anyways, I guess I'll see you in the next one tomorrow at 3pm Mountain Time, US, and I'll see you then. Bye!